Hey guys, it's Izzy from Endless RVing, and in today's Tuesday's tip, we're gonna be talking about the Gorilla Ladder MPX-13. You're not gonna to wanna to miss it. Thank you for joining us, and if you're new to the channel, we invite you to subscribe below. For those who are already subscribed and watching today, thank you for coming back. And in today's video, make sure you stay to the end for some bloopers. If you own an RV, you're certainly gonna be very familiar with the uses of a ladder. We have chosen to use the Gorilla Ladder, the MPX-13. The reason why we use this ladder is several reasons. It's, it folds up into a very compact package. It's an adjustable ladder. It has a max reach in ladder mode of nine feet and six inches. If you fully extend the ladder, it has up to a 14 foot reach. It's a very light ladder weighing in at about 26 pounds. It folds down to a small enough package that it easily fits into our cargo base. Why do you need a ladder on an RV? Well, I, I can't, there's, there's so many reasons, but uh, if you need to access your roof, if you don't have a ladder, if you need to make any repairs on your sidewalls or caulking, if you need to wash your windshield, everybody knows out there, especially on a motorhome or even on a fifth wheel, when you're going down the road in the summer, the front of that RV, it is a magnet for bugs. And one of the first things we do when we get to a site is at least to clean off the front of the motorhome simply because dead bugs are a terror on the finish of your trailer, motorhome, or fifth wheel. So here it is, readily available for sale at the Home Depot or other stores. It retails for about $119. You may be able to catch it on sale if you're lucky. So let's just get right into it and why we chose this, okay? Look at this package, small package. I'm about six foot one, it's right up to my hip. But what's pretty cool about this is it's very easy to adjust the height, okay? You're gonna have three different positions of adjustment. I'm just gonna do your classic, you know, A-frame ladder, but you can do it in different positions. So you have two tabs you're gonna push in to open it up into the A-frame. So here you go, you have a simple stepping stool if you need, but check this out. You got locking tabs on each side, okay? You wanna put them in the unlock position. It's a quarter turn to the unlock position. I'm gonna put it down to the third available adjustment. It'll lock in place. Make sure it's nice and secure. It is in there and now look how much bigger it is, right? Six foot one, look where it's at on me. And look, now look how much more I can do, okay? I can even go up higher if I want. This is gonna allow me to get high up on my sidewall if I need to. If you really want to go crazy, and I won't do this because I'm not that brave, hit the tabs on both sides. Now look where we can go. Now you're really, uh, you're really playing with fire here. So if you want to go really far up on your sidewall if you need, if you want to climb a tree, you can do that. And this all breaks down again to your small little package. I'm not gonna break it down for you, but look at that. Guys, these come in a minimum of 13 feet. They also go up to 26 feet. We do have a 26 foot one that we have at home, um, but it is a little bit heavier. It's about 50 pounds. This is perfect for your RV. If you're interested, I'll put a link below. I don't know if Amazon has it, but if it does, I'll put it below. So that was a quick summary of a great product. We've had this more, longer than we've had an RV, probably five years, and it still works great because of that aluminum construction. It's relatively cheap and is essential. We've used this many times on the RV. Actually, it's, on, it's in the under bay all the time. Guys, if you know somebody that may find this useful, please share the video, the description, all the specs will be below. We invite you to subscribe if you enjoyed the video and also give it a thumbs up. YouTube really loves that. 
So for myself and MJ, who's behind the camera, we thank you guys for watching and we'll see you on the road. Guys, anybody that knows an RV, oh, I'm sorry. Well, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also, so that was a great summary. So here's a, so that was a quick summary of a great product.